My name is Bear Foreman Grills. I served 14 years in the British Custodian Arts. I survived the lacrosse party at Duke. I survived eating a big beef Mexi mouth burrito. And I've also survived the last four seasons of Friends. Now, I'm going to show you how to survive temptation. I got my twigs. I'm gonna go up to the front door. It's unlocked. I've entered the house where temptation is occurring. Right there, I see you trouble in my way. Give me old one, two! Alright, I'm ready to go. As always, I packed my knife, my dental floss, and most importantly, when dealing with temptation, you always need a pack of cheese. Okay, the first thing we do when going against temptation is to take out the TV and the cable boxes in every room. You don't do that. You'll be in a lot of trouble. Be extremely careful when disconnecting your cable. A friend of mine two years ago tried to disconnect his cable, slipped on a banana peel and fell on a picture of Dom DeLuise. When the EMTs found him, he couldn't shit for a month. A lot of people keep old TVs in the basement. You always want to watch. What you want to do, scavenge it around. Scavenger's not a word. Lights here. Here we go. Just some quick hits. Make sure this TV. all the TVs, disconnected the cable, and like a bear, I can smell some porn, and boy, does this man have some dirty, nasty, filthy magazines. The best thing to do is collect them all in a box, grab some gasoline, get a lighter to it, and fire those bitches up so he can never look at them. Now I'm off to the granddaddy of all temptations, the computer room, but this bear's ready for a fight. Get a lot of trouble on the internet. I took the opportunity to smash the computers down and took the phone so you can't call any escort services. And the road is gone, and you're not going to be seeing any porn on my watch. Let's go burn these buggers up. All this smut and naked women has got this bear sort of flushed. If I don't do something soon, I could succumb to blue balls. I'm going to use an ancient Navajo Katie Price survival technique. First, look in the fridge for any type of meat. I'm scavenging around, and I see a sausage. This could work perfect. Now, remember the twigs that I picked up at the beginning. You can use those to make Katie Price's slender torso. Katie Price is one of the most beautiful girls in the world, if not the most. Be careful though when breaking a twig. Three years ago, when breaking a twig, a man snapped it in half. It hit him right in the eye. 
When he went to the bathroom for a towel, he opened up the cover. When he opened it up, he found the old movie jacket from Cannonball Run 2 starring Dom DeLuise. He passed out. When the EMTs found him, he couldn't say the letter word G. And I don't even know what that means. That's how bad it can get. Now that the torso is getting set, make the arms. I've got the arms, the legs. Now what I need to do is make Katie Price's legendary bosom. Now use the survival cheese later to make the hair. But first I gotta cut through. Be careful when cutting through though. Use the knife, make sure you don't cut your finger. You do not want to bleed. Especially with blue balls coming up, I gotta do this quick. Make swift, accurate cuts. Now that I got Katie Price's legendary bosom complete, I need to make the face. Now it's time to work on the head. Go back to the sausage and cut a nice round piece off. Later, I'm gonna use the survival cheese to make the hair. Be very careful though when using survival cheese. Four years ago, a man was camping with survival cheese and ate the whole bag. When he threw the bag away, 30 minutes later, he had to go take a piss. While attempting to walk over the cliff to take a piss, he slipped on the bag that contained the cheese. When he slipped, he fell on a backpack which contained a picture of Dom DeLuise. When the EMTs found him two days later, he was unable to piss for a month. Here we go, we got the cheese ready. Take these gloves off, it'll make it easier. Now that the gloves are off, it should be easier to make and finish the Katie Price. I have her slender physique, I have her legendary bosom, and now I have her hair. She is almost complete, and boy, does she look good. Now, she is the only reliable method when emergency busting needs to occur. Put the leg back there, and she is complete. And now this bear's ready to get off. Bear forming grills, zero. Temptation one. With temptation, you better know what you're gonna do to survive it. And it makes uh, a total. <laughs> This should be plenty enough to get me home and keep the midges at bay. They're forming out. On the next Man vs. Temptation, Bear tries to survive an Idaho car wash from two Norwegian exchange students.